What's up, YouTube? That's all beats back with another video. If this your first time to the channel, as always, welcome. Please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, hit that notification to get notified whenever I drop some heat. All right, woke up this morning, checked my emails, and holy in my academic voice, holy. MPC is coming out with a new stem separation. Check my email, and that's the first thing that was that popped up. New era in sampling. All right, let's go into my email, and I'm gonna show you what I'm talking about. Let's go. All right, we inside the email, so I popped open my email, and this was the first thing that popped up. MPC stems, a new era in sampling. Holy. All right, we've been waiting on this. Didn't know when it was coming. It's not out yet, but you have some um, some guys that's testing it out. I seen um, after I seen this email, I went to YouTube to see if I seen anybody. I seen Bolo did it. All right, did the in, the the review of this, and then Andy Mac. Andy Mac is, is did this part right here. So stem separation is here. All right. Let's go. Let's see. Let's stroll down. Coming soon. Watch the stems in action. Let's go. So I click this button. Took me right here to their page. And you know me, I had to watch the video. Hi there. This is Andy Mack from Akai Pro. And I'm excited to announce that we've now added stem separation to the stem separation is here y'all is here is here is here i'm not going to go through the full video i'm just going to pick out some spots that i thought was nice and that i liked all right so we're just going to look at some parts that i liked all right so let's go through the video man take any vinyl record any sample and extract the stems giving you drums bass music and vocals with incredible sound quality listen i seen the video already but i'm gonna let y'all know the sound quality that I seen from Andy Mack and I seen from Bolo, the sound quality was dope. So let's use our starting endpoints to find the part of the sample that we actually want to stem out. So I'm going to use this section. Now we go to process and we navigate all the way to create stems. Here you'll see our four stem options that you can turn on and off. So if you don't want to stem out the drums, you can just simply turn that part off. Now in program edit, is where we can control our four stem layers. Take out the bass, drums, vocal. Tell me that don't sound crazy. That sounds so crazy, yo. That is crazy. Navigate back to sample edit. We can actually see our four individual layers in waveforms. So here we've got our original sample. And now we got the bass separation, drums, music, and vocals. So here, you could do all your traditional MPC chopping in real time or using regions and then save those as a program and then start making beats with each of the individual stems. Now these are some of Marco. Po now if that didn't get you excited, man, that is crazy, yo. That is fire. I like that. Let's go. Now you can also edit all four layers of your stems by pressing the Edit All Layers tab. And now if you touch the UI and use the data wheel, we can change all of the pitch across all four layers. And the Q links will still control the individual stems. It's coming on MPC software first, followed by MPC standalone. And I can't wait to hear what you will do in the MPC communities around the world. I don't know about y'all, but I'm excited for this, man. I don't, I'm not a sample guy. I don't do sampling that much, but this right here make you want to do it. You know what I mean? It, it it give you that 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 feeling like yo i don't know how to explain it but it make you want to sample right so it's coming it's coming all right hopefully sooner 
then later all right holy let's go man it's here all right catch y'all in the next one man let's go